Hey everybody, jmaco 516 here, back with another review. This time decided to do it on the classic Devastator. However, I do not have this all complete. He is missing like the feet and I think like some weapons and stuff. But, uh, you can see there, um, we have Bone Crusher, who of course is a green steam shovel type bulldozer machine thingy um, and then next to him is scrapper which is just a repaint of him um, over here you of course have long haul he does have this um, hook thing that does extend pretty cool that that back in the place there and then of course we have Hightower who is a purple repaint of the same figure here you can see him in robot mode and finally we have uh, Scavenger back there who is <coughs> sorry still got the cop a green kind of <coughs> yes this would be more of like a bulldozer type machine um, with the course of big claw for one hand just does split to kind of make more of a claw you can pinch you can hold on to things uh, the biggest one of them all uh, there they are all together you can see behind them is Cybertron Metroplex just a size comparison it probably take three or four of these figures just to be able to reach the height of Metroplex there but once they are all combined we will see that comparison um, first real quick quick look at the faces you can kind of see he's got silver a little bit of green black and red he does have light piping eyes there pretty cool they're pretty poseable too um, they do do 360 on the arm he does go up and down on a ratchet joint and of course that did extend that thing is kind of a pain in the butt but his other arm does go 360 also on a ball joint and he does bend at the elbow his legs are also on ball joints they can go forward and back and out same for the other side and of course they do bend at the knee and of course his feet his heels both the front and back do fold but that is for transformation which we will get into and of course he does have this little part here on the leg that does go up and down which that's for part of the vehicle mode which since these are just repaints of each other I will just show the vehicle mode <coughs> of one and then, oh, I guess we, now we have a guest appearance of my, one of my cats, Tinkerbell. This is actually my wife's cat. Get her down. Put that down there. Okay. Um, there is that. This, of course, was long haul. And you does, can see he does have plastic wheels. They do roll quite smoothly. All of these guys do roll pretty well. And that is him. He is green. Mostly kind of 
like a bluish black kind of on the windows there and they're all just stickers none of this is clear or anything um, and of course he, there is the Energon uh, port right there where you put the little Energon chip thingy I do not have one of those out at the moment but you know that is him mostly black and green different kind of shades of green <laughs> with some yellow and silver there on the front over to bone crusher here his shovel can go up and down all his wheels do roll well he is green with also the same blue uh... windshields and, and windows and all that over to his underside you can see a little bit more of his robot form but you can't really tell that these are robots for the most part um, they did hide that pretty well with these guys here he's got a little bit of red and some black back there his wheels do move like this that is for transformation they just pop back into place like that he does have a little ladder right here um, not bad figure over to Scrapper here, he does have this nice purple Decepticon insignia right there. He's a very nice head sculpt, uh, with just gray, black, and kind of red lead piping eyes, if you can see that or not. 360 of them. His, you can see his wheels back here. They almost kind of look like a jetpack, the way they are, just on the back there. Um... His hands do move at the elbow and go 360 and kind of out. His legs go back and forth, bend at the knee, and he's mostly black, kind of grayish. You can see that. Pretty cool. And then finally to Scavenger here, he does have this little tower thing and there you can see Devastator's head but we'll get to that in a moment he does have his nice head sculpt here which is kind of an orange and black with also the lead piping there it's kind of a bluish black nice uh, Decepticon insignia right there purple and some red throughout very nice detail these guys are um, his legs are on ratchet joints they do go out and bend at the knee and also he does swivel 360 round right there and his feet do go up and down but that is also for part of the transformation um, this guy to get into vehicle mode <laughs> is a little tricky so I'm not sure I will cover that I don't really need to at the moment I will take these guys into the devastator mode here in just one moment in order to just achieve this it's kinda like you know I'll take uh, him here and you want to get him into vehicle mode to do that you just fold up the arms sorry pull that down I'll show it I'm sorry out of frame there you take the arm fold it out fold it up make that nice and flat and fold that down now you can kinda see he's starting to take shape you just fold these wheels down and then let's see this whole part here just unclips from the front and folds around that folds up these legs let's see if I can remember how to do this Fold, okay, yeah. 
I need to spin these around. I can just remember how. Let's see. I know. Three. Spin that around. And then kinda wait a second. Oh, I missed a step, that's why. Rotate the whole waist around. And now you can pop those into place. Show you better on this side. Rotate that. <laughs> Put that down. And then sort of just fold the wheels down. And then fold the steam shovel down. And bam. You have a vehicle mode. High tower. Or I believe that's who this one was. Is a little bit easier. I'm going to fold these up. Same thing on the other side. Yeah, do move that. Oh yeah, that does stay like that. Fold these in. Fold these in. They do have a peg here and a peg there, which line up into the hole here. And there. Those just snap together, hold the whole thing up, and I forgot this part does go around like that. Spin this whole thing around. Oh, sometimes that does pop out. That. whole thing just kind of ratchets